So before I ever started driving for Roger Penske, I'd of course heard about him. You know, being from Michigan uh, and him being a, a Michigan-based guy, owning the Michigan National Speedway, and kind of the legacy he had, of course, not just owning the tracks, but then being an Indy 500 winner many times over, even when I had first met him. Uh, I think I'd heard of his pedigree for uh, results, uh, excellence, uh, and really this kind of stoic figure that he was. The first year or two, what stands out the most to me was first time how well career. things were going on the Xfinity side and how poorly things were going on the Cup side. And it was such an interesting time in my life because I would race, you know, the preliminary races and feel on top of the world and race the cup races and feel, you know, like nothing. Uh, Roger Penske's willingness to work with me through that process was really pivotal uh, to our success, and I'll never forget that time period. Without, you know, number one, these guys are jealous of the job he's done this year. He's won six races. He's made poles. He's been up front. And nobody likes to see a guy win like that. I think there were several key moments for me of self-realization at Team Penske that this is going to become a dynasty. When we won the Bristol night race in 2011, that was a huge moment for me. That was a, I think I got out of the car and even made the comment that, you know, uh, champions win this race. Probably the biggest hot streak that I'll remember forever and I really cherished was when we won three cup races in a row. The Darlington Southern 500, Brickyard was in there, a huge win for me of course and then 500 at Las Vegas. Those three weeks it was one of the best times of my life. You never stop setting goals, right? It's the, the great thing about it. I've got so much more left I want to do. I feel like the best is yet to come. I really we do. We ticked off a number of them, you know, winning championships. Winning a lot of the majors, you know, with the Brickyard, the first one for Roger Penske, the Coke 600, the, the, the Southern 500 we forget about in motorsports is just how much of a team sport it really is. You know, team Penske has uh, close to 500 people and everyone plays a key role in seeing the race cars be fast. Uh, I'm just constantly reminded by how important each one of them is and the credit that they deserve is uh, immeasurable. The legacy we have together is we took a NASCAR program that no one really believed in in 2010 when I got there, into a perennial championship contender for an entire decade. Ultimately, 12 years is a tremendous ride. I'm not gonna say it's more than I imagined, but the success we've had along the way was everything I could have imagined. To my fans, to my sponsors, to my team, and to my car owner, Roger Penske. One final note I wanna say as I wind out my time at Team Penske, thank you. Thanks for everything you've done for me. Thanks for the commitment support you've given to me and my racing career throughout the years. Couldn't have done this without you. And I appreciate you now and always.